What's going on YouTube? It's BA Sports. Uh, I'm back to show y'all another jersey that I just picked up. I'm gonna start this video off. Uh, I took a two week vacation and uh, took a cruise uh, down to Mexico and uh, had to board the boat in uh, Long Beach, California. And, I, and, and I'm from Kentucky, so I had like a four hour flight to LA I stayed a day in Los Angeles. Then we boarded a Carnival Miracle cruise ship. Went to Cabo San Lucas for five days. Came back and then I stayed three more days in LA. So during this three days that I had in LA, I had tickets to two hockey games. Cause my quest to visit all 32 NHL arenas, I needed to go to Staples Center, which is now crypto.com and I needed to go to the Honda Center. So I done bought my tickets. Anyway, so we get there and we get back off the cruise and I find out that on Monday, the 27th of December, the Ducks game against the Sharks had been postponed or whatever they want to call it, rescheduled. They haven't come out with a schedule yet, but. So I didn't get to go to that game, which dearly pissed me off. You know, I spent, $1,800 to fly out there, and there is three of us, me and my girlfriend and my son. So we spent $1,800 just on plane tickets, and then I have the tickets to this game that I now can't use because the NHL wants to postpone games over the COVID bullshit. So anyway, I do get to go to my Kings game, which they lost to the Golden Knights, 6-3. to three. But while I was there, I went ahead and picked up this jersey from the team store, which is the new alternate jersey for the LA Kings. It's a prime green. It has the shiny background, which I'm not sure I'd like because whatever this in here is made, in, made of, it's like a plastic vinyl and lucky lucky for me i don't wear my jersey so i'll probably won't have to wash it but i'm not sure how this would hold up in a washing machine so if any of y'all have this jersey and you wear it and you wash it please let me know how this holds up because i'm very i'm very curious to how this will hold up with wear and tear but anyway beautiful jersey beautiful jersey R really really like the glitter and the sleeve stripes and the hem, really nice. Looks better than Vegas is actually. Vegas did this in the third jersey, but the whole jersey, as you all know, is, is this. But something about the silver, I think it looks better. Uh, it, it's a blank, because you all know that anytime you buy a, a jersey through NHL or Fanatics or even at a team store, they do the cheap ass vinyl names and numbers, and I'm just, no, not for me. So, even though I'm not really a Kings fan, because I love the Sharks, I'm not really a Kings fan, and I'm not really a fan of any of those players that they have. Uh, I may get this customized down the road, no hurry. Maybe years from now, maybe never, I don't know. But if I did, I'd probably go with Robitaille or somebody like that, you know. Uh, but it is a nice jersey, and I did desperately want to add it to my collection. It's a prime green jersey. It's got the two Stanley Cup crowns in the collar. Nothing on the logo is really raised. For it to be a prime green, like nothing is, nothing's raised up. So I don't, don't really understand that concept. Nothing's really like 3D or whatever the hell they're calling it. But it's still a nice jersey, and I'm glad I picked it up. But uh, I just wanted to show you guys that. I uh, hadn't been on here a few weeks. I've got like five other jerseys that I need to unbox for you guys. Uh, one of them my girlfriend had got me for my birthday, which happens to be Christmas Eve. And we were in Mexico. So she surprises me that this last go around of mystery boxes that Cool Hockey did, she actually surprised me with one. And I didn't know she'd got it. So she hid it in her suitcase we're on the cruise ship and she pulls out this jersey. 
So I'm like all excited, you know. I'm like, hell yeah, you know. So I won't officially get to unbox that for you guys because I had done unboxed it for myself. But I'm going to show you guys that. And then I have, uh, I know, four more jerseys that I haven't unboxed. I haven't opened. They were delivered while I was gone. And I'm going to do that. I'm going to try to fit all that into this weekend. But thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please do. Uh, this gives me opportunity to talk about jerseys with you guys and show off what I have. I haven't got around to doing my full collection yet. Uh, I just I stay pretty busy, and it's kind of hard to fit that into my schedule. I'm still planning on doing that for you guys. Uh, it'll come one day, I promise. Uh, but if you haven't subscribed, please do. Uh, give me a like. Give me a follow. Uh, and I'll get back with y'all in the next video. Thanks for watching.